there were no injuries to suggest any other person was involved in the death of missing teenager Gallia Pope, police have said. The 19-year-old's body was found on Saturday in a field near Swanage, 11 days after she was last seen. Dorset Police is treating her death as unexplained pending toxicology results. Three people were arrested on suspicion of murder as part of the investigation and released under investigation. Death Superintendent Paul Kessel said, the post-mortem examination has not identified any injuries to suggest any other person was involved in her death. The cause of death is undetermined, pending toxicology. The coroner is involved in the oversight of these examinations, but at this time this remains an investigation into an unexplained death. Mississippi Pope, who had severe epilepsy, had not been seen since November 7. Her disappearance prompted a massive campaign from family and friends who spent days scouring the town. Items of clothing she was wearing on the day she went missing were found on Thursday, close to where her remains were found near a coastal path. Police thanked volunteers for their help in searching for the teenager, but have asked people to stay away from the site due to safety concerns. Death Superintendent Kessel added, I reiterate this area is steep and slippery in an exposed area close to sea cliffs. The area is covered in dense undergrowth and gorse and can present a hazard. The area where the body was located is likely to remain cordoned off for some time while forensic examinations and searches are concluded. Earlier, Mississippi Pope's twin sister, Maya, spoke of her heartbreak and vowed to make her sister so proud. On Facebook, she added, can't find any words right now. Galia is my everything and I am heartbroken. I thank everyone who was involved in searching for my beautiful twin. Her elder sister, Clara Pope Sutherland, said the 19-year-old was the light of my life and intelligent, beautiful, and emotionally wise. Floral tributes have begun to be left on the Alfred Monument, next to the sea front. Family friend Sherry Carr, who organized the Find Gallia social media campaign, thanked the public for its support. We are absolutely devastated, and unable to put into words our feeling of loss, she wrote on social media. On the day she went missing, Mississippi Pope was seen at about 15 o'clock GMT buying an ice cream at St. Michael's Garage, having been driven there by a relative. She was then spotted an hour later on CCTV in Manor Gardens, off Morrison Road. Rosemary Dinch, 71, her 49-year-old son Paul Elsie, and 19-year-old grandson Nathan Elsie, all of whom were known to Miss Pope, were questioned by detectives and released under investigation.